Welcome to Fun Fair. I'm Andrew. And I'm Nathan. And of course, at the end of this year, it's once again another trip to a galaxy far, far away. Oh yeah. Finally get the wrap up of everything from 7 and 8. Get to find out some reveals, some secrets. That's right. We get to see how J.J. Abrams tries to undo things that Ryan Johnson has did. Yeah. When he should just leave them be. But uh -huh. As we know, it's probably things are going to be undone. But, but of course, there was the big reveal uh, earlier this year. Yeah, uh, with, with the, the trailer. Yeah, with the trailer, the laughter of the emperor. So yeah. the emperor is, is back, back, baby. Palpatine. Yeah. Insidious. Yeah, that's the right. Emperor. So yeah, he's back. Last time we saw him, he was getting thrown off a, a freaking yeah. ledge by the Darth one. Yeah, Vader threw him right off that freaking half-assed Death Star and. We thought he was gone for good. But no. He's yeah. back. So we got to figure out here, how the hell did he get back? Like, yeah. What he's been doing all this time? It's been a long time. So I, so what's your theory on this? Uh, my theory is this. The Emperor found love. Okay, so yeah, so he kind of just he, he went and had the simple life. Is that basically? Well, you know what? He changed his ways. He's like, fuck, the Death Star didn't work twice, so I might as well find the true love. Because that's that's what you want from the Emperor. Yeah, love you can tell story. great stories <laughs> afterwards. I'll tell you about Plagueis the Wise. And I picture him. Vienna. I picture him walking around in like a Hawaiian shirt. Yeah, you know, and she's just like, I love wrinkly faces. She's like, let me tell you how I got it. I mean, <laughs> So you're saying that we could do like a whole emperor trilogy of like yeah. him finding love. Yeah, and then you know raise the kid. Raise the kid. Yeah. yeah, you know that's a great idea. I think you're gonna piss people off with that. No, one that's though. so good. She's like, Dad, I, I need a bedtime story. I'll tell you about the prequels. And then, you know, she goes right out after like the first twenty minutes. <laughs> okay, fair enough. And then the poor boy said, "Are you an angel?" <laughs> oh, you're a sleep angel. Oh, that's perfect. That's, good. that's really good. Okay, well, that's a good theory. Yeah. Do you want to hear my theory? Yeah, let's hear it. Here it is right here. The Emperor fell through a time portal. So, yeah, so the time portal. And it's like, he's really pissed off. Like, what the fuck's going on? You know, like, what the hell's going on? Everything's changed. Luke, your hair, you know, like yeah. that's, I think that's gold. I guess that's okay. Like, it's kind of typical for Star Wars though, you know? Time oh. portals though? Yeah. Come on, this is instantaneous. He fell through and suddenly it's like 30 years later. Like, come on. Yeah. They haven't done time portals. In I it. feel like it's been done in, a, in other yeah. stuff. In other things. stuff, but not in Star Wars. This is Star Wars time portals. That means there's no rules. It would be like a social commentary on, you know, today's boomer generation where they're like, everything's changed, I don't like it. What is this? I can't make my TV work, you know? Yeah. Think about the universe saying, how do I make this TV work? Can I be the best? That, yeah. <laughs> Who's this Snoke? Thank God he's dead. Yeah. I'm the real one. Yeah. I'm evil. I'm the only ugly looking guy yeah. in this how franchise. How dare they get a new ugly guy? <laughs> I'm the original ugly guy. I think it'd be great. I think it'd be great. But you know, what are your thoughts? Do you want to see, what is your thoughts on what's happening with the Emperor? Where has he been? What's he been doing? Did he find love like, uh, like Nathan yeah. prescribed here? He could have. That's a very nice story, but it's the Emperor. Emperor should have a nice story. Well, like then, you know, like they could, like, yeah, no one would expect it. That's yeah. true. No one would expect it. No one That's would right. expect him to find true love. <laughs> They'd be like, that guy will never find love. That guy is not lovable. So thanks for watching. This was season one of Fun Fair. We got through it. We got through it all, yeah. I, I had my bets on the other way. Uh, yeah? You're going you're gonna think we're going to make the full episode count? No? No. All right, well, we did it. And uh, we will be back in the new year. And we're going to have some great stuff. We're going to make it some more jokes. Talking about things, there'll be more gameplay videos, which yeah. I know you're very excited we're about. We're only going to get better. Yeah, we're only going to get better. You, me, the old man. No. The emperor. We need to get rid of him. More flutes. <laughs> more flutes? Less old man. Okay. We'll talk about that in the interim. But uh, for now, enjoy the rest of the year. We'll see you in 2020. Have a good new year. You know, Merry Christmas. Happy 
All those other holidays. Oh, we all of it, you know? American Thanksgiving. Yeah. Halloween. That's a good one. Yeah. So there yeah. you go. Have fun at all of those. Have fun. We will see you after New Year's. Hopefully you're sober by then. <laughs>